we are going to show you the amazing new Unreal Kismet from Unreal Engine 4. Shane, let's see some of the cool stuff that you've been able to do with it. Here's a quick little game I made. Just to, I've been just trying to make different kind of control schemes and things just to see what an indie developer would run into if they were using the tools. Uh, you can see that there's some little dolphins that are chasing me around here. So that's basically some simple AI that I set up for these guys. You know, this is all done totally by me just with inside Unreal Kismet. How long did it take you to do something like this? Um, I did this probably a couple nights messing around. Wow. You know, and that's making content as well as the effects and the sounds. And I mean, you have to make everything from scratch. So, I mean, it's total freedom to just, you know, basically design whatever you want and actually make it work, you know. To me as an artist and a game designer, like I've never felt this unleashed before, being able to just do what I want without having to bother the programmers and get them to do it. You can just try it and see if you like it and tweak it and it's really fast to just pop in and out. And So this is a flying game I made. Um, this probably took, actually I did most of this on the free Friday we did, a little game, you know, time to do whatever we wanted. Let's go ahead and give it a shot. See what you All do. right, let it run. Oh yeah, the triggers will turn your rotor here. You can see that all the elevators in the rotor all work according to. So what you've it hooked be up doing. every flight surface on this. Yes, it totally works like a real plane should work. Hey, let's see. Let's see what happens when you invert the controls. I'm more thinking I like the inverted style of controls. Okay. How tough is that to do? So it's so easy to tweak. Um, so I'll just pop back out here and I'll go over to the. So this is the kit. These are. This the is the blueprint notes. for that so plane. So zoom out. Show me how complicated something like that is. So that's, this that's is not the controls much, for all it? the plane and working all the surfaces on it as well. So. Wow. You have complete control of all the controller inputs? You have total control of everything, basically. You can do whatever you want. So I'm just taking the raw data coming off the stick. Here's where I've set up the, the strength of the controls. So I'm just to invert it, really, all I have to do is actually just set that to a negative number and then compile it and then play it and then now try it again. Oh, yeah, that's way more natural for me. I think I can probably get that guy now. <laughs> <laughs> yep. What Kismet, the new Kismet means for gamers is that the artist's vision flows unfiltered to them because now the artist can go. actually do exactly what they want. You might have had to walk down a hall, ask a programmer how to do that, and wait to get his interpretation of it, and the programmer is too busy cleaning up a 100,000 other little things that because programming is so much more complex. It's your vision and nobody else's. So now the artists and the designers are just able to get this direct translation from their brain and their creativity to the gamer's hands. Exactly. This is your little cool okay, so Mars like, demo. Yeah, I made a little hover ship kind of dude. Um, can I play? Yeah, you can play. So what? Are, so what am I doing here? So you know, oh, you can move him around. You can shoot his. Yeah, it's a dual you stick made a shooter, twin basically. Stick shooter. Yeah, basically, oh. with a hover ship, right? And uh, you can see that there's some subtle movement going on. Like if you just pan left and right, you can see that his head will tilt the opposite oh, direction, wow. and the base of his ship rotates accordingly. And as you turn his head around, like he'll turn his head, and then the turret will turn afterwards and lag behind it That's a little impressive. bit. That's impressive. And I noticed there was a little uh, shock wave you could do too. Yeah, there's a little shock wave. You can see if you shoot that, it'll blast the uh, the blocks around. And you got physics hooked up there. Got physics hooked up. Wow, that's Unreal Kismet for Unreal Engine 4 is just unbelievable. Thanks so much, Shane. Great, man. It's awesome.